Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Uh, I was thinking the other day, I was like, you know what, our personalities, okay, they're not that different, but like, what were we like in high school? And would we have been friends in high school if we had met then? What do you think? Yeah. No, I think no. You think no? I think no. no <laughs> okay. You seem pretty confident. Been, we could have been friends because, yeah. Many, many, many things. Okay, well, tell me, what were you like in high school, first of all? Mm, in high school, mm -hmm. I was a good guy and okay. a bad guy at the same time. Okay, good yeah. guy. And a bad guy at the same okay, time. Okay, how can you be good guy and bad guy at the same time? <laughs> <laughs> you have to explain yeah. it to me. Uh, it's a lot happened. Uh -huh. Let's see, I used to hang up a lot with the bad boys, you understand? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes, but not bad boys in a bad way. The popular boys, understand? We were so popular. I don't understand. You have to explain, because bad boys to me has a certain kind of, kind of connotation, bad. you know? So when you say bad boys, what do you mean? Like, uh, It's something like, what can I explain? They didn't yeah, really we, care what the teachers thought. No, no, we 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 did care because you're observing the rules and regulations. But uh, you're those these kids that you are uh, all over understand. If it's like football, we are there on football. Mm -hmm. If there are other games, we are there on the other games. So we used to be all over. You get me? But yeah, I was a big noise maker when I was in in high school. Noise maker, like you yeah. were noisy, you made lots of noise, or you got into trouble. There is what we call noise making. Uh -huh. It's when maybe because for me, I don't like reading books when I'm quiet, I like reading when I'm discussing with someone else. Uh -huh. So, when other people will say that it's, people will, will say you're making noise, but it's not noise, it's a discussion. But sometimes it can be out of what you're discussing, uh -huh. just bring other stories in between. Yeah, such things. Then, yeah. So you were like talking, talking when you weren't supposed to be talking, like during yeah. preps or something. Yeah, like during the preps, and uh, I, I didn't like people telling me to chat up because I like talking sometimes. Yeah. So See, he's what, talkative. So he's <laughs> denied it before. <laughs> so he's that, talkative. <laughs> that's why I'm saying I was somehow bad boy somehow because I didn't like someone to tell me to shut up. I like talking. Why are telling me to shut up? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So your interests when you were in high school was football, which is soccer for Americans. Yeah, yeah, soccer. Football, what else? Yeah, music? I was running also had a music, yeah, music there. I also had music because I was uh, running DJing when I was still in high school. Yeah. At the same time, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Yeah, so but most I was on soccer and that's music. That was what I was doing most. Yeah. And I was making. And noise making <laughs> as a hobby. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I was somehow a bad boy somehow. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So me in high school yeah. was different than I am now. I definitely was much more quiet. I was shy, mm. but also I was very I was serious. Like I did not know how to take a joke. Wow. <laughs> wow. So I had fun in my own way, mm. but I don't think other people thought I was that fun. Maybe some people from high school would remember. I think differently, but my perception is that people were kind of like, I was kind of like a stick in the mud. Do you know? Do you know what a stick in the mud is? Um, it's like <laughs> someone, someone who's like wanting to be a noisemaker, and then I yeah, would come yeah. in and be like, guys, that's not what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to yeah, be see, quiet. No, I would be the stick in the mud. Yeah, no, that's how I was saying. If you if you are the same school and count time is shut up, I shut up. No, no, no. I mean, I wouldn't say shut up, but. Yeah, guys, so guys are making noise. No, you're not making noise. You're discussing. And I, I think back on my high school time is, I definitely intimidated the, the male students. Serious? Yeah. How? Because I was much taller than them, or as tall as them. Yeah. Because I had hit, a, I was tall before I even went to high school. So some guys had to catch up to my height, basically. Yeah. <laughs> they did, but I think. That intimidated them, but also I spoke my mind. Yeah, yeah. So I would just be like, I would tell them how I would tell them my perspective, yeah. even if they asked for it or not. And so I know that I kind of like freaked out some some guys in my school. 
and uh, yeah, so I think that would have definitely been a barrier. And the, so the things I was interested in in high school, I was involved in marching band, jazz band, concert band, lots of bands, different choirs. I was in the plays, but I didn't act. I did the behind the scenes so that's stuff. That. I did speech team. Um, I did. Oh, I did do fo football, soccer for two years, but I, wow. I basically sat on the bench. Yeah. But I was on the team for two years, so went to all the practices and all that stuff. Wow. So, so I did a lot of things, and I was pretty busy. So I don't know if we would have. So you were popular in school? No. Serious? I would not. Wow. I would not call myself popular. Me, I, I was popular in primary school. I was popular in high school. Okay, okay, calm down. Yeah, I, I changed when I went to college because I have to keep calm down. low profile. Yeah. yeah. I would not say I was popular. Okay, so in our school, there was definitely cliques. You know, there was the band kids, there was the theater kids, there were the athletes, the cheerleaders, you know, like there's different, different cliques. And yeah, I mostly knew the band kids, yeah. but I never really felt like I fit in totally with the band kids. And I kind of didn't fit in with the speech kids. I didn't really fit in anywhere, so I kind of had friends from different, I, different groups, you know? Yeah, Mia was very popular because I used to hustle so much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I used to hustle in high school. Okay, you need to explain that because no, we didn't have no, boarding I, I, schools. I, I, I'll explain next time. <laughs> I'll explain next okay. time. High school, I used to hustle a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I used to hustle a lot because I was in boarding schools. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was in boarding school. Then I went to I finished in adult school, but most of I was in boarding school for two years mm -hmm. and the day school for two years. Okay. So I used some to, differences there. Yeah, so I used to hustle so I, that's why I was popular. Also in primary school. In primary school I was popular because I told you guys if, if you watched our stories last time. The childhood stories. Yeah, yeah, childhood stories, yeah. We used to organize fights in schools, in primary schools. <laughs> the bad boy. Yeah, then I used to be captain in in primary school I used to be environmental captain. Mm -hmm. So I was popular because I had to Face some other kids to go to water the trees and uh, collect the litters in the compound. Mm -hmm. Then I used to be in football team when I was in primary school. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but a, a very very competitive team because we used to win a lot. Yeah, yeah. So that's why it was popular. Anyway, there are so many things. Uh, in high school, I will not say those things because. <laughs> interesting. There are yeah, stories yeah, there. Very interesting. Exciting. <laughs> you come to the uh, stories next time. Okay. Yeah, you have the part two stories next time. Okay. Guys, I have to. You, yeah. Wait, before you continue, yeah, yeah. I do have to ask like, when you were in high school, do you feel like your personality was pretty much the same? Or did your personality change since high school? It changed a lot because in high school, yeah, for my personality changed for, let's say, when I was in that term of Form 3. Okay, very yeah. specific. Yeah. Yeah. So it changed, but uh, you know, I do tell people many times, uh, I don't know if I have told you this. You know, there is somehow you can advise people or tell people to change, but you no, know, you cannot make a decision for them to change. Yeah, it's, it's true. Decision comes with you, it's up to you to make your own decision to change. If you cannot change, no matter who, even the, if you spend the whole night praying for a change, it will not change until you, you yourself you make your own decision to change. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's when I made my decision. <clears throat> I'm changed until now. Wow, just like that. Just like and that. And that change was positive. because I, I didn't meet positive. you. It, it was, was positive. Yeah, it was no, positive. No. Yeah. Not positive, but I'm mean, okay. Not positive or negative, but just like, where did it go? Like, what is, what changed about you? I'm just curious because I never met you, and there's no videos of you from high school. Like, I can't <laughs> go watch some videos. You don't have any of those. So, yeah. I mean, I can ask your friends and family and see what what you're like in high school, but I want to hear from you. Like, how did you change? In what ways? In many ways. In many many ways. Many ways. <laughs> just many ways. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. I guess that's all I'm getting. Because I know from high school, I changed. I became more outgoing, more assertive. I definitely don't let people walk all over me. 
for me, I just, yeah. I just became serious with life. Because when I was in high school, when I was, yeah, when I started high school, I was not serious with life, you understand? Mm. It's when your parent tell, tells you, you need to study, you need to study, but for you yourself, you just, yeah. You don't like it? Yeah. I got you. I just tell you need to study. Those who have studied, they have gone where? They're just here around with us. So mm. why should I study? But uh, then later on, I said, no. I saw life in another angle. Mm -hmm. That's when I made my decision to change. Ah. Until now. Okay. Yeah. That makes a lot more sense. Thank you yeah, for explaining yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, I wouldn't have quite understood that. Yeah, yeah. So, there was a lot of things that I changed. You know that I don't want. <laughs> <laughs> so, what about you? Tell us. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I, I've definitely changed since high school, and I, I hope I'm a more, like, generous person. Yeah. Not so cold. I was kind of, I don't know. But again, you know, you can ask someone from high school and they can say, oh no, I thought you were really friendly and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. But my perception of myself in high school was like, I was just kind of like, I didn't mess with anyone's, like if they were annoying me, I didn't handle it. I didn't have much um, understanding in that way. I was just like, no, these are the rules. You follow the rules. If you don't, you're wrong. I don't want to hang out with you. But I will say like, Okay, not saying that all people from Africa are the same, but there was one student who was from Tanzania who was on the speech team with me, and he was, like, super, super popular. But he was, I, we called each other, like, brother and sister, and he called my mom and dad, mom and dad, which yeah. is kind of funny. But, no, I loved, I loved hanging out with him, and I think our personalities got along really well. Yeah. So I think that's, so even if, you were like the bad boy. I think if you were at my school, say you were at my school, like an exchange student or something or whatever, I think we could have gone along because I am interested in other cultures and asking people about their cultures and yeah. learning. So I think in that aspect, if you had just been like picked up and taken to my school when I was a kid, I think I would have wanted to be your friend and learn more about your life and yeah, all that stuff. So in that way, I would have wanted to be your friend. Even if you were too cool for me in high school, I think I would have been your friend. Yes. Thanks. Oh, I thought we were doing our special high five. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so the consensus is, the final answer, would we have been friends in high school? Uh, maybe yes, maybe no. That's what I can say. What about you? What do you think? My personality in high school and your personality would not have collided, except for... So that means no. Unless, <laughs> unless it was a one-on-one, -on -one. yeah. like if we were on a group project together and we were working, like we we're partnered up for a paper or something. Yeah, I think yeah. then we could have been friends, but if we were just happened to go to the same school but didn't have that like one-on-one -on -one contact, I don't think so. So okay. yeah, it's just funny how <laughs> it's just funny how life, you know, and change, yeah. you have to meet someone at a, a specific time. Yeah, yeah. In true. your life. Yeah, yeah. true, true. Yeah. Thanks for talking to me about this. Welcome. I think I learned something actually. I didn't mm -hmm. know. So, I also so I can much. say I learned, learned something about you. I discovered something. So guys, please <laughs> go to supporting us by subscribing to our channel there. Subscribing is free. So just hit that button. And for the next content, yeah, you're gonna see what is coming. Something lovely is coming. So please subscribe to our channel. It's yes. free. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, thanks so much. Yeah. Want to say that something? No. Okay. Thanks, guys. Mm -hmm.